Hello and welcome to marketing91.com. In this video, we are going to cover the topic on top 13 automakers in the world. Please note, the rankings are based on 2020 revenues. At number 13 with revenues of $28 billion is Suzuki Motor Corporation, known for making automobiles, four-wheel drive vehicles, motorcycles, all-terrain vehicles, outboard marine engines, wheelchairs and a variety of other small internal combustion engines. It is based out of Japan. The multinational firm has the third highest sales of motorcycles in the country. Along with Japan, the firm manufactures in 23 countries. It has 35 manufacturing units overall. In addition, it has ties to 132 distributors. As a result, its products are available in 192 countries and provides jobs to about 45,000 people. Next, at number 12, with a revenue of $31 billion, is Tesla. Tesla specializes in clean energy and electricity-driven cars. In addition, it sells a variety of clean energy products. These include solar roof tiles and panels, etc. It also provides battery energy storage that supplies grids and residences. It is based out of California. It has been operational since July 2003. It was set up by Mark Tappening and Martin Eberhard. Back then, it was called Tesla Motors. The firm's present CEO is Elon Musk. He has held the spot since 2008. He began as one of the chief investors at the start. The firm is named after electrical engineer and pioneer Nikola Tesla. Tesla sold about half a million units across the world in 2020. It also managed to manufacture more than a million vehicles that year. The sales spike amounted to a 35.8 increase from 2019. As of June 2021, Tesla offers four car models, the Model S, Model 3, Model X and Y. The firm's first vehicle, the first generation Tesla Roadster is no longer sold. Upcoming products include the Roadster, second generation, semi-truck and the Cybertruck. At number 11, with revenues of $72 billion, is Nissan Motors. The Nissan Motor Company oversees a line of electric vehicles. Its most successful electric car, Nissan Leaf, holds the second spot by sales worldwide. It is only beaten by Tesla's Model 3. The multinational car maker is based out of Yokohama in Japan. The firm owns multiple brands. Some of these are Datsun, Infiniti and Nissan, which sells cars. In addition, there is another brand called Nismo. It exclusively sells in-house performance tuning at utilities. In 1999 and later of 2016, Nissan teamed up with French Renault first, then the Japanese Mitsubishi. This formed the Renault-Nissan-Mitsubishi alliance. Moving on, at number 10 with revenues of $88 billion is Hyundai Motor Company, a multinational car maker. They make sedans, hatchbacks, crossover SUVs, vans, pickups, heavy trucks and buses, numerous plants worldwide. It is based out of Seoul, South Korea. The company was established in 1967. Since then, they have managed to acquire two markets. These are Genesis Motor, the luxury car maker, and Oinik, the electric vehicle sub-brand. Moving on, Hyundai now also has a 33.8% stake in Kia Corporation. Hyundai runs a manufacturing unit in Ulsan, South Korea, making 1.6 million vehicles a year. This makes it the world's largest integrated vehicle manufacturing center. Hyundai cars are distributed through almost 5,000 showrooms and dealerships. The company provides jobs to 75,000 people employees globally. In addition, customers can buy their vehicles in 193 countries. At number 9, with revenues of $98 billion, is Stellantis. Stellantis caters to the automotive industry. It distributes cars under the Abarth, Alfa Romeo, Chrysler, Citroën, Dodge, DS, Fiat, Fiat Professional, Jeep, Lankia, Maserati, Mopar, Opel, Peugeot, Ram, Vauxhall brands. It is based out of Amsterdam in the Netherlands. It is a multinational automobile maker. The firm was set up in 2021. It resulted from a merger between Fiat Chrysler Automobiles from Italy and PSA Group based in France. Both companies are equal partners. About 300,000 people work for Celentis. Customers can buy the vehicles in 130 countries. These are produced in 30 nations. At number 8, with $106 billion in revenue, is SAIC Motors. SAIC sells vehicles under a variety of brands. Brand names that are exclusive SAIC include Maxxis, MG, Rove and Eugene. Products produced by SAIC joint venture companies are sold under mark use including Bergeron, Wick, Chevrolet, Veco, Skoda, Volkswagen and Wuling. Saic Motor Corporation Limited is based out of China. The Chinese government runs the firm. It makes vehicles from the manufacturing units across the country. It also has units in Halal India and in Thailand, not to mention the Long Bridge Assembly Plant in United Kingdom. The multinational car make and designer was first called Shanghai Automotive Industry Corporation. At number 7, with revenues about $112 billion, is BMW Group. Bayern Motor Work, or a BMW as it is popularly called, specializes in motorcycles and luxury cars. It sells cars under the brand BMW, Mini and Rolls Royce, and motorcycles are marketed under the brand BMW Motorrad. 
It is headquartered in Munich and produces motor vehicles in Germany, Brazil, China, India, Mexico, Netherlands, South Africa, UK and United States. The German multinational has been in operation since 1960. It started by making aircraft engines. These were made in two phases in 1917-18 and 1933 to 1945. BMW almost had to declare bankruptcy in 1959. However, Harold and Herbert Quant's funding managed to pull the firm out. At number 6 with revenues of 121 billion dollars is Honda Motors. The Honda Motor Company makes power equipment, motorcycle and vehicles. It specializes in the car and motorcycle industries. However, they also make garden equipment, marine engines, personal watercraft and power generators and other product. Honda is based out of Tokyo in Japan. The multinational conglomerate has held the top spot among motorcycle makers since 1959. It managed to make 400 million units by the close of 2019. Honda was a pioneer in the luxury car industry in Japan. It gave the country its first exclusive brand, Okura, in 1986. Key cars now include the Honda Accord, Civic, and CR-V. At number five, with revenues of 122 billion dollars, is General Motors. General Motors is involved in the automotive industry and provides financial services also. It also offers its services to the military. GM Defense is the wing that presides over this. It tries to come up with propulsion mechanisms and technology for military automobiles. It is based out of Detroit, Michigan, in USA. Its headquarters are located in cities in an Nissan Center. It was set up on September 16, 1908, by William Durant. It became the biggest vehicle manufacturer globally in 1931. It would remain a global leader until 2007. At the height of its success, it provided half the vehicles bought in states. General Motors has production units around the world. Its four core automobile brands are Chevrolet, Buick, GMC, and Cadillac. General Motors sells vehicles through 12 brands it owns. It has managed to acquire stakes in foreign brands such as 20% stake in IMM, some other brands such as Wuling, Boeing, and Jeffang. It also has 77% stake in GM Korea. About 200,000 employees work for the multinational corporation. Its vehicles can be bought in upwards of 140 countries. At number 4 is Ford Motor. Ford Motor Company sells luxury and commercial cars and automobiles. The regular cars and automobiles are distributed through the Ford brand and most luxury cars under the Lincoln brand. It is based out of Detroit in Michigan. The multinational firm is famously referred to as Ford. The firm gets its name from Henry Ford who established it. The company was incorporated on June 16, 1903. Ford started selling entry level luxury vehicles in 1938. They were distributed in the Middle East, Canada and states under the brand name Mercury. The Mercury brand was disbanded in 2011. Ford had acquired UK's Jaguar in 1989. The same year it also bought Aston Martin which specializes in sports car. It also purchased Land Rover in 2000. Both Land Rover and Jaguar were sold to Indian automaker Tata Motors in March 2008. Ford has also kept 8% shares in Aston Martin after selling it off in 2007. Also Ford owned the Swedish automaker Volvo from 1999 to 2010. Ford also owns Brazilian SUV manufacturer Troller, an 8% stake in Aston Martin of the UK and a 32% stake in Jiangling Motors. The Ford family still has minority shares in the company. However, they have a majority voting capacity. Thus they practically run the firm. Ford is listed on the New York Stock Exchange. At number 3 is Daimler. Daimler runs or has stakes in various automobile brands. It is based at in Germany. In common phrasing it is called Daimler or more famously as Mercedes-Benz. So the cars sold under the brand of Mercedes-Benz, Mercedes-AMG, Smart Automobile, Detroit Diesel, Freightliner, Western Star, Thomas Build Buses, Cetra, Bharat Benz, Mitsubishi Fuso, MV Agusta, as well as shares in Denza, Kamaz, and BAIC Motor. These are various brands that deal in motorcycles, trucks, buses, and cars. In addition, the Daimler Financial Services arm also operates in the financial services industry. Daimler sold luxury vehicles under the Maybach brand between 2012 and April 2015. Today, Maybach cars are sold as Mercedes Maybach versions of Mercedes Benz S Class and Mercedes Benz GLS Class. At number two, with the revenues of two forty nine billion dollars, is Toyota Motor Corporation, a multinational firm that oversees the designing, making, promoting, and selling of automobiles and hybrid electric vehicles. The group produces vehicles under five brands: Toyota, Hino, Lexus, Rans, and Datsun. It is based out of Aichi in Japan. It was set up by Kishiro Toyota. The firm was incorporated in nineteen thirty seven. Toyota was the world's first automobile manufacturer to produce more than 10 million vehicles per year, which it has done since 2012, when it also reported the production of its 200 millionth vehicle. It also holds a 20% stake in Subaru Corporation, 5.1% stake in Mazda, 4.9% stake in Suzuki, 4.6% stake in Isuzu, a 3.8% stake in Yamaha Motor Corporation, and a 2.8% stake in Panasonic. And finally at number 1 with revenues of 254 billion dollars is the European giant Volkswagen Group. 
Volkswagen Group designs, makes and sells commercial and passenger automobiles. It also caters to the turbo machinery, engines and motorcycle industries. It is divided into two primary divisions, the automotive division and the financial service division. The firm also helps out with fleet management, leasing and finances for these products. The firm is based out of Wolfsburg in Germany and owned by Porsche SE, part of the Austrian German Porsche and Fiat family. Volkswagen has been operating since 1937. It was founded to make the cars that came to be known as Beetle. No other automotive firm has a bigger market share in Europe. It has maintained this distinction for the last 20 years. They distribute passenger vehicles through the brands Audi, Bentley, Bugatti, Lamborghini, Porsche, Seat, Skoda, Volkswagen Mark U, light commercial vehicles under the Volkswagen Commercial Vehicles brand, motorcycles under the Ducati brand and heavy commercial vehicles where the Mark U's of listed subsidiary Traton, MAN, Scania and Volkswagen Camionas. Volkswagen caters to 150 countries and it runs 100 manufacturing units in 27 countries. So that's it folks. This brings an end to the topic on top 13 automakers in the world. These are the list of sources and links referred to for the content in the video. Thank you and see you in the next video.